But when you put the two together, it makes it somewhat of an easy call for the official. I never like to disagree with you when it comes to officiating. <laughs> Jalen Brown guarded by Okoro. He's going to elevate. That's a deep three, Ooh. and he hits. So back-to-back -back threes, Tatum and Brown, and we're tied. As he misses inside. We'll get a better look than that. Jalen Brown sneaking back door, make it 10 straight for the Celtics. And J.B. Bickerstaff up out of his chair with a quick timeout. Creation of this kid, Evan Mobley, who's got so much talent, he's going to be called here for a foul to put Jalen Brown at the free throw line. Defensively, we can't let him get comfortable. You know what I mean? We got to come out, get stops, and then figure it out from there. Thanks for stopping. Good luck. Thank you. We crossed the nine-minute mark early in the second. Brown eyes lights up against Niang as he takes him to the cup. Boy, it looked like Brown and Struess got tangled up as they exchanged words. I don't think Struess appreciated yeah, it. That's a great point. You know, if you look at their team, he was one of only three guys that had a positive Cleveland plus. Celtics minus. have it, but the momentum shift has been stark to begin the second half. They get it into the corner. Horford's been quiet tonight. Offensive rebound, Brown flicks it back up, and he's going to shoot free throws. So Isaac Okoro now one of seven from the field, make it one of eight, and he's 0-4 from deep. Brown gets his arms locked up. He flicks it up and in. Just masterful offense. Knew where the contact was coming, the body control, and it's a five-point lead. Yeah, and that's one of those situations where it's great attack by Brown, and if you're Cleveland, you've got to bring help. You can't allow a great offensive player to take three, four dribbles that close to the basket. And you see Jason Tatum. He's a fan. Allen, another DMP for him with a painful rib contusion. Levert. Short arms to three. Rebound Holiday. In the, in the last five possessions, as you see Jalen Brown understanding they're in the penalty and going into attack mode. Underneath out of bounds. Tatum is going to throw into the front court to Pritchard. And here we go. Pritchard again playing significant minutes. Now to Brown. Working against Levert. Elevates. Tough shot. And he sticks it. That is an all-star shot. And Jalen Brown's we got 22. On the five minute mark. The Cavaliers showing some fight. Boston looking for the answer. Brown is fouled. They say that Struess got him just below the waist. And by five, 115 left. Tatum trying to turn the corner. Brown from deep. He buries it. Tatum and Brown, the two stars, trying to get it back to Boston and a potential 3-1 lead. And the join continues here in Cleveland on TNT. And I love the fact that Tatum was willing to make the right read there, create that opportunity for Brown.